What I think is next, for 12 years now we've been talking about industry and Wall Street and financial services and all 11 sectors of the S&P going on chain. In other words, getting involved in blockchain. This is not about speculating the price of Bitcoin. This is about using a technology as a ledger system for real estate, for car sales, for consumer goods and services, for digital payment systems. So the idea of a blockchain becoming integral in business and every aspect of the economy. And so, you know, when you think about investing in crypto, it's not just speculating on tokens, it's will the integration occur? And, and the way I'm thinking about it, because I'm watching this happen, and I'm spending a lot of time in places like Singapore and others where in Abu Dhabi, Dubai, where a lot of developers are, AI is going to crash into blockchain, is going to crash into Wall Street. They've prototyped technology already where you're, you have your phone, you're beside a famous burger joint, and all you have to do, without using an app or anything, is simply talk to your phone and say, I want a tall, low-fat latte, please. I'm going to be there in 90 seconds. That's it. So what happens there is the AI analyzes where you are, looks at the geography of what retailer that is, determines that that's the one, and then uses a blockchain to actually do a digital payment system for the tall, low-fat latte. It already knows who you are, so the retailer has your name on it when you walk in. The problem we have is that all the chains that were developed, the reason I bring this up is everybody on this call knows what Solana and Ethereum is. But this weekend when we had the meltdown in the crypto market, they didn't perform very well because they're both single lane highways. So when you put a transaction on Ethereum, it's behind the one that came on just before you. It's a long highway on a way to a toll road for authentication of the transaction. And when there's too many going on the highway at the same time, they get stuck at the toll. They get jammed up. And the way you get out of the jam on ETH anyways is you pay more to move your car closer to the toll. This weekend, there were transactions, $2.50, it cost you $1,300 to get them done. That makes no sense. So. We don't have the technology yet with at least those level ones to do what I just described to you because if everybody in the world is ordering a burger at the same time, that's 10,000 per second or whatever that number is. They all have to get through the toll simultaneously. And so I'm focusing on the developers that are moving in that direction for solving for chain. And if those of you that are interested in this and engineers, this is a fantastic career because the Walmarts, the Targets, the Burger guys need millions of transactions a day, all independent, all going through the tolls at the same time. Who's going to do that first is the question.